फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर कवरिंग हेयर इन द आर्क आर्क मैप इन बिटवीन हाउ टू क्रिएट द पॉइंट एंड लाइन ग्रीडिंग बाय यूजिंग योर स्टडी एरिया शेप फाइल्स वी कॉल दैट स्टडी एरिया मैप एंड आल्सो द अप्लाई ऑन योर क्रॉपटेड स्टडी एरिया मैपिंग सो वी आर डूइंग योर प्रैक्टिकल्स सो just go to the uh, arc map environment here we are having that this uh, layouts and uh, table of contents so in between layers in table of contents you can uh, select on the first options you add here shape files so first i remove this uh, title uh, actually how to create that so we are heading all that not required just remove it just add the uh, study area click on that this is my study area and just uh, i reducing on that to uh, change the color no color to no thing on that you can look here the in between the colors is having so we are removing that no color okay so you just see in the border so now we require to uh, also add here the multi sectoral data so uh, your study area i am cropping that multi sectoral study area data so but uh, i want to just grading point view so first uh, we are doing on the practical sessions just go to the system tools in between uh, having a uh, data management tools just click on that we are dragging here just click the features option in between having the fish create the fish net Actually, uh, we go with the feature class. Click on that. Here, uh, having the option. Suppose uh, we are searching here. The we need to. Uh, finding here the feature cla class in between the uh, create the fish net so but uh, we didn't find out in, in between your sometimes doing uh, facing you like this problem so go to the search options in between you can see here the below this search option you click on that just just click on that and here uh, you type type here create fish fish ne create fish ne and search that uh, you op open that uh, options first option is there is open that you can look at the all options i fill up one by one here we just uh, this is our output features class so now we give the name of that class just creating the folder fish net and this is the file folder name
study area of fish net or be also uh, calling that the grid just save it uh, uh, template extend the options we just selecting there the as a, our study area uh, as layer or uh, same as your study area layer so you got the top left right bottoms positions on that also line to x and y coordinations also got uh, got the by using that so uh, cell uh, size width is uh, counting in the meter so we are calling here the uh, 5000 so we very easy to explore our pixel so uh, just i dragging it on the top so you clearly look and here uh, next option is the number of rows so we not required to add that so we are cover here the width and height number of columns also not required to here and uh, uh, you can see here the options uh, of post for not to fish net x and y coordinations you see by that so here most important point is it create the label points so i show you this uh, create label point uh, you can select that and uh, in between having the geometry types options so you click on that you got the lines and polygon so now we just select the polygon and uh, first we select the polyline and then we go the polygon just uh, click okay you got the result got this result by the 5000 meter pixel so we uh, also measuring on that distance by uh, selecting on this options as a major click on that and just from this point to this point you can look here options Pixel to this pixel, you uh, segment the five thousand uh, meter to length is the five thousand meter. So you uh, also adding here the some uh, mm -hmm. another features. Suppose I add here the multi-sectoral data, so you can look here. the which positions uh, how much area cover by the 5000 by 5000 meter so you very easily got the uh, your study area or ground truth verification options so we are visualizing this points and just click on yes here in this points green points we are covering here check you can okay uh, you can here study area grid label just click on that and change that color as your choice and also change the shape of symbol so your uh, find your informations so you just you can also change that is very this size so you reduce the size of that it is very huge to you identifying that we are changing point on the circle this uh, reduce the size of that take only the i think uh, 
therefore it is better okay yes we are zooming uh, times we are getting exactly so hope guys uh, you enjoy in this tutorial very interesting you can add here the your study area you can also add here the base map just click on that and add here geographical field to add that or we are also adding here the another option number of options we have available give it a few seconds typical uh, we adding here the base map just uh, add, dragging on that uh, table contents so you, you can make it very easily just uh, go to this options add base map and uh, i am choosing on the imagery options already uh, i am choose that's why i am not adding that again you can just uh, click on that you can look here the two options are available your study area are exactly uh, pointing on that so, and as your choice you can just uh, add the selecting your uh, area just point data just and grid data this grid is option uh, grid line i just show you the highlight on the bold line just select you can look this so your study area is covering by that so as uh, our choice uh, we are adding we are adding here the yellow color on that line remove the size of that line reduce the size of that line you can got the very uh, easy result And that uh, again, uh, these two files are creating by the create the fish net in the fields. We are also adding here the yellow points. We are e very easy to finding that. Okay, so uh, hope you guys enjoy in this practical session. And also, you want to add your multispectral data. Suppose in between, just click on that. Uh, multispectral data you want to add the ndy data so you adding there you, you want to uh, creating the point point view on that you also add on that So do not forget to share and subscribe my YouTube channel Do It New is the name of Do It New and also press the bell icon so I continuously provide you the updation about the new new updates tutorials about the RGIS arc map and another in Miradas GIS tutorial. So please share and subscribe. So it is helpful me and you also. So thank you guys. We will meet the next tutorials.